this concert's coming from a classical context. This is definitely a classical concert with improvisation. I'm excited about doing that because it's bringing me back to my classical roots. Um, I get to play music that I love and uh, I get to, to be creative in, in a way other than just interpretively. The Bach la Jazz is, uh, is a fun thing. My friend uh, Ben Charret asked me to, to play the, the, the C minor prelude from the Well-Tempered Clavier in the style of Glenn Gould. So they wanted me to sort of loosely pose as Glenn Gould. And then it goes into Bach la Jazz, which is my jazz arrangement. So it's a very traditional thing. So I'm, so I'm not breaking new ground there, but it's fun to do. duet number one in E minor. I play that, that piece and then I do a, a free improvisation that's just inspired from that piece. That'll be completely different every time because it's free. third Bach piece, the Preambulum, from the uh, fifth partita in G major. The Preludium itself is a very virtuosic uh, Bach piece. It's one of his more virtuosic pieces, so that's a lot of fun to play. first movement of the, the Schumann Piano Concerto in A minor. At first it's kind of a you know, romantic style improvisation and then it turns into a kind of uh, Latin groove as well. I mean it's uh, besame mucho, is, one can hear that in there. Toccata is a fun, uh, a fun piece. This is one of the great challenges of the piano repertoire. The uh, the improv is um, kind of R and B jazz, sort of. Uh, you know, think of maybe uh, Fats Waller.
I take this, uh, this beautiful little gem of Chopin and turn it into a rather a big romantic improvisation, meditation on, it, it really could be called meditation on etude in E major, because <laughs> that's basically what it is. It's popularly known as la tristesse, uh, the sadness. But um, it, it just doesn't sound really that sad to me. It sounds more reflective. Another great Chopin etude. It's 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 a big challenge for pianists. Uh, every pianist tries to play that etude. I decided to to kind of jazz it up with a boogie woogie bass line. section I added a, a sort of a, a melodic line underneath, uh, sort of a la Rachmaninoff or so. That's uh, my arrangement um, of uh, the Great Concerto in F uh, for solo piano. Uh, I was uh, thrilled to, to record the CD of uh, my arrangements with the Concerto in F Cuban Overture, and uh, I've, I've played that program to death. It was nice to pull it out again.